The last person I'd like to talk to you about is Takashi Harada. Well, I've been to Japan, believe it or not, 88 times. I'm going back there tomorrow for my 89th trip. And it was roughly about seven years ago, I was teaching at Portland State University, um, teaching the best of Japanese management, when four students came over to me and they said, uh, Professor Bodek, um, we want to intern with you. And I didn't know what to do. I mean, I knew what the term was, but I never had an intern before. And then I called my friend uh, Nakamura in Japan, and I said, Nakamura, you gave me a copy of this map. Now, this map is amazing. It divides the company, the plant, into 33 segments. And then it says in each segment, like quality, what is the world's best technique in quality? And the next column says, who's doing it? So you break down your plant into maintenance, into productivity, into training, into automation, into all the different aspects, the major aspects. And then you get a group of people to ask, what is the best tech, what's the best technique in quality? Well, at the time, this is about 10 years ago, um, when the map was done, um, one of the best techniques was Six Sigma, or total quality management. Well, who were the best companies in the world doing it? Well, at the time, it was General Electric and Motorola. Well, every week, Nakamura in Japan over Skype would teach me and my four students how to, how to understand this map. Well, the seventh week, there's a column, and the column says standard work. And it says the world's best technique for standard work is day-to-day -day management. And the best people that are doing it is Takashi Harada. I didn't know who Takashi Arata was, but Nakamura started to explain to me that he's a coach in Japan, coaching a technique called the Harada Method. I looked up on Amazon Japan, and I found that he wrote seven books on the subject. I ordered all seven because my wife is Japanese, and it just turned out that three of the four students studying with me also knew Japanese. So we gave the books to the four of them. Very quickly, they came back and told me what the Harada method would, was all about. And I got all excited. And I called Mr. Harada through my wife and said, I want to take one of your books and put it into English. Because you see, that's what I've done the last 30 years. I've translate, had translated over 100 Japanese management books and put them into English, including Ono's and Shingo's and so many other great people, and put them into English. I went to meet Harada in Japan. I said, which book should I do? And he says, Norman, I don't want you to do any book. I was a little bit shocked flying all the way to Japan. And then he laughed and he said, Norman, I want to write a new book just for you. And then I said something magical. I said, Mr. Harada, I want to co-author that book. I want to introduce it to the West. And he said, fine. And he translated, he sent me 120 pages and I produced a book over 400 pages, trying to give my understanding of it and introduce it into the West. And then I said, in the method, the method is the following. It asks you to, to pick a goal of what you want to do the rest of your life to become a master of. What do you want to do with the rest of your life to be successful at? And so I flew back to Japan, and I got trained with Mr. Harada. Then I came back, and I filled out all the forms. And by the way, I'm very happy to send you all a set of the forms. All you have to do is send me an email to Bodek, B-O-D-E-K, at P-C-S, Peter Charles Sam Press, P-R-E-S-S dot com, Bodek at P-C-S Press dot com, and I'll send you a copy of the map, and I'll send you a copy of the forms that you could be, you could be ready to fill out. But you're most fortunate, because Jim Lippins, who's at this conference, came from Belgium to America to become certified in a workshop that I set up. And he's a great trainer, and he's going to be talking more about the Harada Method with you. And he's put the book into Dutch. I'm sure some of you could read Dutch. And then Walter, <laughs> who's working with uh, Jim, has just recently put the book into French. So I recommend you get a copy of the book and use Jim as a trainer to teach you how to do the do the Harada method. It is very, very powerful. In fact, the, where all this came from is Harada was a, a uh, junior 
a, a coach at a junior high school in Osaka. And it was the worst school in the city. He couldn't get winners out of his students. And he came up with this method. And after he came up with the method, he, his students won 13 gold medals. 12 students won 13 gold medals. That means the student was the number one athlete in all of Japan, not just in Osaka. Never happened before with any high school. And Mr. Harada became very, very famous because, because of, of what happened. Not only uh, academ I mean, scholastically, but academically, the whole school rose up from that method. It is so powerful. One student in another school by the name of Shohai Otani, and I'll send you a copy of one of the forms filled out by Otani. Otani filled it out, and his desire was to throw a baseball at 99 miles an hour because that was the fastest it was done in Japan. He wanted to join the major leagues in Japan two and a half years later after he graduated high school. Well, two and a half years later, he graduated. He was the number one person picked. Three years after, just three years after, he's the number one pitcher in Japan. Not only throwing at 99 miles an hour, he hit 102. And he had the best record last year of a pitcher at any of the baseball teams in Japan. And he was also the number one batter. Never happened before in Japanese baseball batting and pitching at the same time. In America, it only happened maybe 100 years ago to somebody called Babe Ruth. Well, the, the funny thing in this story is the New York Yankees is willing to give this man, Shohai Otani, $100 million to play baseball for them. I love that story. It doesn't mean if you follow the Harada method that you're going to become a great, great, champion in baseball or football or soccer. No. What it means, though, if you do the Harada method, you can become a great you. I'm not saying you're not great now, but you can continue your greatness to your infinite creative capacity. Well, I hope you liked my short talk. I thank you very much for inviting me. I look forward to getting emails from you. Or you can just approach uh, Jim Livens and he'll give you the forms in Dutch because my forms I'll give you in English. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, please send me an email. I'm very happy to answer your questions. And I love your country very much. I've been there many times. I've been to Amsterdam and Rotterdam. I went to Rotterdam when I was 19 years old, my first trip to Europe. I love your country. It's the cleanest country in the world. I mean, I can drink your water. I can drink your milk. I love your flowers. You're the most productive farmers in the world. You're amazing people. You should teach everybody to live the way you do. Thank you very much.